This is Eric Moa with Mother.com with another video trying to explain and emphasize the need to understand uniform activity. Now, we can all agree that on hindsight, this is a fake move. This is very fake because it also coincides with a previous breakout attempt that was unsuccessful. So that period on hindsight is definitely a trap or was a trap, right? Because after this failed breakout, we roll over and of course we've been lower from that time period. Now, let me remove all that stuff. One thing you might notice is if you really look at this, this is almost a uniform action. We have two weeks up here and here, followed by almost an identical behavior but in the opposite direction. So that is price showing some uniform action. But that is not easy to see. So let me propose that the RSI gives you a better view. Why? Because the RSI is in a way a measure of average price action. All right, let me propose two lines. Line number one, right there, which connects the previous lows, then turns into a sell signal here, rejection, rejection with uniform activity, and we can see again rejection here with uniform activity for the ultimate most recent weekly closing high. So this is uniformity rejection at this level. In other words, this behavior here gives us a more noticeable and uniform action rejection as compared to what the price gave us. So it is easier to identify the uniform action rejection here as compared to price. Now I'm gonna propose another line connecting the previous RSI high and this point there, and I'm gonna extend it out. It should be something like that. In other words, connecting this high, this high here, and this high. In fact, what I can do, let me start all over again so we can see it clearly. So I'm gonna draw a line connecting the high, this point, bear with me, this point and this point. Like that. All right, we can agree. It connects to those points that I've drawn. Now, notice this is uniform action above the red line and back below it. In other words, it looks something like this. Uniform action above and back below. And so this area is uniform action above the line back below it, which is this period, which gave us this top here. And if I bring back the previous line, you can see how combining all this information and understanding the power of uniform action gave you reason to be cautious here turned out to be a major high and that is the power of understanding uniform activity a method that i have researched for years and if you don't hear it from other people it's because this is my own derived method eric mother to mother.com as always good luck peace and blessings e a c s